Well, hello, everybody. Welcome to Collector Probs. Anything you collect, you're going to have problems with. Something. Figures, movies, uh, everything in between, I deal with. Oh, yeah, I'm doing this video on my new phone. I got a new phone, Samsung Galaxy. So hopefully the picture will look better and I can do everything with one phone now because I used to use two phones. I used to have one just to talk and text and do things. It was horrible. It was just a cheap phone. And the other one, I had a Galaxy 7 Edge that I've done videos probably the last five, six years with. It was getting old. It was messing up, doing a lot of crazy stuff. So now I got this phone. So hopefully this will look a lot better. Uh, and I can do everything on one thing now. So that's cool. But collector probs, today's topic is sun faded media. Yeah, going to flea markets and stuff, and going to some of them where the same people set up a lot of the times, and they put out, you know, they put the DVDs and VHS or whatever they got in big old plastic Tupperware things, I call it, uh, and they set up all the time. And they're out in the sun and they don't have nothing to cover them. Yeah, that makes it sun faded. I don't even look at that stuff anymore. There's some of them I've been to that's so bad, I don't even look at. When I start seeing the sun faded stuff, I won't buy anything from them. Uh, would you buy something that's really rare? Um, probably not. I'm real picky about my stuff. And I don't want something sun faded. Some of them are so bad, it's crazy. And people think people, um, maybe somebody will buy them. I don't know. Uh, not this guy. I, I won't buy them. Uh, will you buy them? I don't know. But yeah, it's crazy. You go to the flea markets and you see people with some faded uh, DVDs, Blu-rays, or um, VHS. Mainly it's VHS and DVDs. You don't see a whole lot of Blu-rays sitting out too long. Uh, and hell, half the time I don't ever see Blu-rays, period, at a flea market. But anyway, yeah, that's that's one thing that's very, uh, very bad. Now, people still buy that stuff, though. I don't buy it. Uh, it, it, it just don't deal with me. It's a collector problem for me. Um, that's the biggest thing you would have at a flea market. Also, when people set up too early uh, in the mornings, and you know how you get that little dew over stuff? People do that with movies and stuff sometimes. And then when it dries, it gets underneath that plastic and gets onto the, the paper and it gets water damage. That's another one that I want to talk about that happens to flea markets. Water damage stuff. I have got stuff that had a little bit of damage before. Uh, but uh, yeah, you, you set up way too early. They don't cover it up. And they ended up with, you know, that... Um, that do there and then it dries up and it's wrinkled and you know the paper and everything uh, i have got stuff like that before but uh try not to um in case it's something i really 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 want you know what i mean but the sun faded stuff is probably the worst drinking my coffee here just looking at the picture on my new phone here and i'm trying to figure out hopefully i'm looking at the right camera button here on my phone so it looks like i'm looking straight at you instead of looking at myself i, I hate when people look at it like this they'll look at their self while they're filming i hate that look over here in the little hole where people film at just one of my pet peeves when i do videos um but yeah some faded dvds don't go Oops, sorry got this on the table Got my tripod here with my little ring light. My big tripod, I won't won't work with this phone because I got a case on it and they just don't want to hold it. Uh, so I had to use this one with the ring light. But that's the collector problems. I mean, some faded uh, DVDs and VHS. Stuff. Most VHS nowadays, people just throw in a box. So it might not get real faded. They don't set them out like the DVDs and stuff do. Uh, but the water damage stuff too uh, any other collector problems with buying physical media at flea markets if you know any of them 
give me a comment at the bottom. Sorry this video is so short. There's not really a whole lot to say about it. The sun makes the, the stuff, you know, fade and the water makes it water damage, basically. That's the only two I know right now to talk about on collector problems today. If you have any other ones that you want to talk about or I forgot to talk about and you want to let me know, give me a comment at the bottom of this video. And that's it for this one. Till next time.